All right, so we have had these chicks for two weeks. And here is what they look like. We just tried to put some tags on them, but they seem to still be too small. So we took the tags off. And we're just going to tell them apart by knowing who the heck they are for now. We have moved the heater up another notch. It's now as tall as it gets. No doubt we will be seeing some chicks fly into the side because they don't seem to uh, understand the changes immediately. Filling their food. You you filled that that much yesterday? And I put some in the base, but this base still has some, mm. so I'm just gonna. Hi there. Yeah, they're starting to eat an awful lot of food. All right, girls. There's poop in your food, so we're gonna remove that for sure. Whoop. Which one is this? Don't give up. Watch out! Watch out! They're in this uh, kind of funny in-between stage where they're starting to get feathers around their neck. So their neck down looks all ridiculous. <coughs> Pardon me. side too. All right, Beth. All right, Beth. <clears throat> the Easter Eggers especially seem to be uh, very hand friendly. Well, at least Amelia and Victoria. Caroline is less so. <clears throat> so our grayish little Easter Eggers really like having the back of their neck pet. Food went away and came back, and now it's time to eat. <clears throat> Must be something new. You don't think Luna's a boy? You see how I react with other ones? Like... <clears throat> yeah, she is probably one of the least aggressive chicks in the bunch. Tail is finally coming in, so who knows why that's late, but. Come here, fuzzy neck. <clears throat> wow. You're fine, Caroline. You're fine, Caroline. You're fine. All right, all right. She is not fine. She is not a fan of being picked up. She was fine. <clears throat> she didn't think she was fine, but she was fine. Yeah. Kind of a big fan of the featherings going on in uh, Beth and Jane over here. Those are some surprisingly pretty feathers for reds. It's not At least I was not expecting that. They're getting pretty fast along the ground, too. Yeah. Come here, Amelia. You're a little bit better. Can we show your fro off? neck feathers coming in. Might be kind of itchy. But she tends to really, well, put your thing, put yeah, your hand under her. Adjust how I'm holding her. They're getting kind of big for one hand. Yeah. Once they feel like they have something to stand on, they calm down a bit. You gonna close your eyes? Mm.
And now as we raise this, I think more of them fit under there again better. Hello? Yeah, I know it was an accident. Surprisingly quiet time right now. So they're all underneath the heater, more or less. Jane, that's not quite meant for standing on, but you found a way, huh? Caroline pecking at the wall over there. Maybe I can get down underneath a bit. I'm not quite sure what to make of the foam. Alright, little chicken butt. Alright, that's our update for today. Still not big enough for leg tags, and the heater went up to its highest setting. They're quite vocal these days, too.